Hello folks, today we will talk about some rental properties terminology from tax point of view. So, what do you mean by available for use when you rent a property? You can claim capital cost allowance, CCA, on a rental property only when it becomes available for use. So when does a rental property other than a building become available for use? A rental property other than a building usually becomes available for use on the earliest of the date you first use it to earn income, the second year after the year you acquired the building or the time just before you dispose of the building. When does a rental property that is a building becomes available for use? A rental property that is a building or part of a building usually becomes available for use on the earliest of the date when fully constructed building is purchased or construction of the building is completed or the date that you rented out 90% or more of the building. The second year after the year you acquired the building or the time just before you dispose of the building. So what is capital cost allowance? In the year you buy a depreciable property, you cannot deduct its full cost. Depreciable property such as building, furniture or equipment wears out or becomes outdated. You can deduct a percentage of the property's capital cost over a period of several years. Depreciation is the part of the cost you can deduct that allocates part of the cost of the property to the current fiscal year. The term capital cost allowance is used for income tax purposes. What is capital cost? It is a one-time setup cost of your rental property after which there will be reoccurring operational costs. The purchase price, not including the cost of land. The part of your legal accounting, engineering, installation and other fees that relate to the purchase or construction of the rental property, excluding the part that applies to the land. The cost of any additions or improvements you made to the rental property after you acquired it, provided you have not claimed these costs as current expenses, and a building's soft costs such as interest, legal and accounting fee, property taxes that are related to the period you are constructing, renovating or altering the building. If you have not deducted these expenses, as current expenses. Legal and accounting fees for buying a rental property are allocated between the cost of the land and the capital cost of the building. If land is acquired for rental purposes or for constructing a rental property, the legal and accounting fees apply to the land. When determining the available for use date, a renovation, an alteration or addition to a building should be considered as a separate building. You may be able to claim CCA on a building that is under construction, renovation or alteration before it is available for use. You can deduct CCA that you have available on such a building when you have net rental income from it. The CCA you can deduct is restricted to the amount of net rental income 
you have after you deduct any soft costs for constructing, renovating or altering the building. What is a capital property? It is generally any property including depreciable property you, you buy for investment purposes or to earn business income. Common types of capital property include principal residences, cottages, stocks, bonds, lands, buildings, and equipment used in a business or rental operation. What is a depreciable property? It is usually a capital property that is used to earn income from a business or rental. You can claim a capital cost allowance on depreciable property. The capital cost can be written off as CCA over a number of years. What are proceeds of disposition? It refers to the sale price of the property. It can also include compensation you received for property that has been destroyed, expropriated or stolen. What is undepreciated capital cost? It is the balance of the capital cost left for further depreciation at any given time. The amount of CCA you can claim each year will lower the UCC of the property. Folks, we can help you with your Canada and US tax issues. Contact us at 416-283-8774 or visit us at www.theaccountingandtax.com.